Hello everyone here, Chris Capri, founder of Second Skies. Today's video price action video is on breakouts, rejection, and acceptance of value in a pair. So we're going to talk about the pounding stock on the one minute chart here. Uh, this, this time frame actually really highlights the essence of what we're talking about today. So this gray line here represents the London Open. And the market started trading in between two pivots here, which means that there was an agreement upon value. Uh, it wasn't overvalued, it wasn't undervalued, it was uh, comfortable in this value. Uh, area in between here. You can always calculate the value area for a pair uh, based upon the most amount of touches of price it has. So the more time it spends there and the more touches it has upon a particular price level, the acceptance of that value is uh, agreed upon between the market. It's kind of like if uh, oil gets too high, eventually people will drive less and they won't accept the value of it. So the oil companies and gas companies will have to lower the price until people start purchasing again. Otherwise, they're in danger of not being able to sell their oil. So it's the same thing in the currency markets. What is interesting here is that the market tried to break out of the range uh, of, that it had set in the early London. And also what it tried to do is also, we're going to set the lower range here. We'll talk about that in a second. But it tried to break out of it here. However, the market wasn't accepting the value of this here. It was too, it was overvalued at this point. So what happened, it began a very big sell-off. And in that process, it broke through the lowest value of the Asian session and started to print at lower range here. Now you can see that the value area here is somewhere right around here. This is where the most amount of price is touching here, both the support and resistance all the way along. Ironically, very close to a pivot. So the market is accepting the value here. Now, if the market wasn't rejecting it, or if the market wasn't accepting it, we would see a rejection, kind of like we did over here. Uh, this quickly, this fast, the market wouldn't accept it, so it had to send it up higher above this pivot to gravitate around this pivot. The market was comfortable with it here. Um, but the thing started spending more and more time here. So the more time it spends there, the more comfortable the market is hanging there, which means that the people that were currently in control of the market, the sellers in this case, are still in control. If there was a shift in control, the buyers would have re-auctioned the value back up and challenged the sellers who came in around these upper regions here. So since the buyers weren't able to do that, what happened with the market, the people who are already in control remained in control and sent the pair down. And now they've created a new area of value for the pair on an intraday basis. Um, so now the value area is climbing in right around 65, 64. And the longer the time it spends here, the more comfortable the market is holding price here, which means there's an agreement upon who's in control and who's not. So this is just one of the advanced price action tactics that we teach. Uh, and this is actually a small portion of the advanced price action tactics we teach in chart reading skills, uh, either in the private mentoring or in the Pro Forex course. Uh, for this year, uh, there are only three more spots left in the private mentoring. So if you're looking to get some high quality education uh, to really advance your learning curve, uh, to learn advanced techniques, rule-based proprietary systems, then I suggest the private mentoring. It's tailored around you, your time frames, your needs, um, the style that you're looking to trade. It's all tailored to work with you. Uh, if that is something, if there's another alternative out there, there's the Pro Forex course where you learn also the same rule-based systems. Um, it's an internet-based course that you uh, learn on your own time there. Um, with that comes two months of the Cloud9 signals. Uh, so you get, uh, once you finish the course, you get free uh, for two months the Cloud9 signals and you get one follow-up private session with me. Uh, all that is for only $350. It's an absolute no-brainer in terms of price uh, and what you're getting out of it. In fact, check out our website to learn more about uh, what we're offering there. So if you have any questions about our services, feel free to check us out at secondskiesforex.com. And you're also welcome to email me directly, info at 2 Until then, good hunting, everyone.